Warning, the following video contains 100% authenticity, facts and logic only, and is toxically masculine. So, if you're easily offended or you don't want to learn something new, then fuck off and go be a pussy somewhere else. Throughout your life, you're going to experience pain, and that's inevitable. But what you can choose is what pain you face. Because you see, guys, as I said it before, you know, your life is a result of a bunch of choices that you make, right? You know, out here in California, there are a lot of homeless people. I mean, in, in LA, it's, I'm pretty sure it's like 70,000 or something. It's crazy. You know, but some of them, here's how it goes, right? They do hardcore drugs. They owe somebody money. They screw somebody over. And then, boom, you know, they end up in the streets, right? They made all those choices, and now they have their end result. So, with pain, it's basically the same thing, you know? There are two types of pain. The first one is short-term pain for long-term pleasure. And the second one is short-term pleasure for long-term pain. Now, I'm going to give you an example, and I'm going to use showers as an example, okay? I don't know how long you've been following my channel, but I used to take really hot showers, like, about two years ago. And I don't mean just, like, warm. I mean, like, if the handle was here, I'd move it all the way, you know, as much as I could to make it as hot as I could. That would be, you know, sort of a short-term pleasure. It was enjoyable, right? 10 minutes, 20 minutes, 30 minutes. But as soon as I was out of the shower, it was horrible, you know, horrible. My skin felt horrible. It was all dry, you know, itchy, right? You know, the clothing felt uncomfortable, you know, a lot of like white little flakes. It was just horrible, right? You know, consequences after. But with cold showers, right? Depends how cold you want to make them. Obviously, the colder, the more challenging. But it's not really pain. I enjoy them. But we could take it as pain because, I mean, it is uncomfortable, right? So it's sort of short-term pain for long-term pleasure. Because once I get out of a cold shower, I've been doing them for about two years now, my skin will feel amazing. You know, I wouldn't feel dry. You know, I'd feel fresh. I'd be awake, you know, since I'm bald. It feels nice on the head, right? It would be much better. You know what I mean? And what I've come to realize is that this, let's say, thinking method with how you, you know, what pain you choose to face and how you face it, you can apply it to everything in your life, right? At any time you have a decision to make, right? Because, you know, I always talk about thinking logically. I don't really, I, I don't think I've ever talked about, you know, acting logically, right? Because let's say acting logically versus acting emotionally, right? If my man Greg gave the example there, there, let's say I'm, I'm drinking this five hour energy, right? And I spill it here on my computer, right? You know, the emotional reaction might be for me to say, fuck, you know, and to bash the computer or, or just scream or whatever. The logical one would be to find the appropriate things that I need to use and then clean it up, right? So, with pain, it's the same thing, right? And with this, you know, I've said before, guys, we need, we need to be doing the work now that we're young. You know, I'm 18 years old. You might be 16. You might be 17. If we do the work now, you know, if it feels uncomfortable when you work out. It might feel uncomfortable when you spar, you know, the physical stuff, you know. It might feel uncomfortable. You're not making enough money at the beginning, you know, financially. I might feel uncomfortable. You're not getting the girls you want. I know I can't get the girls I want right, right now. You know, I, I can't I can't get fucking tens. I can't get nines. I can't get eights. What can I get? Like a six, seven at most, you know? It's not what I want, right? And I'm sure, you know, in a lot of areas in your life, you might feel the same right now. But you need to understand. That's why it's important that we work right now, you know? Because if we do, you know, this short-term pain, we're going to be able to experience long-term pleasure, you know? Once you're... 25, right? Let's say I'm 18 right now. Once I'm 25, have a good amount of money, you know, physically, you know, no acne, you know, good physique, you know, big dick, right? Jelking, be leveled up much more in, in all the areas of life, right? You know, it, it might have been a bit painful at the beginning, right? Again, pain, you know, but the pleasure is, is completely worth it. Or you could choose the other one, you know, which is pleasure right now, you know. You know what? I'm not going to get girls. I'm just going to jerk off, you know, jerk off, jerk off, jerk off, you know? Oh, I don't, I don't really feel like eating this, you know? I'm just going to have some McDonald's, you know? It's, it's tasty, you know? Yeah, those guys are boring, you know? All they talk about is money. I'm going to hang out with these losers who talk about, I don't know, fucking Drake, right? You see, guys, this applies to everything in your life, you know? Every decision you make, it's either going to lead you to long-term pleasure or long-term pain. All right, guys? That's really it, you know. Choose wisely. As I always say, guys, work on yourself, work hard. And remember, you know, if it were comfortable, everybody would do it. You know, you don't think everybody would be in shape if it were something easy. 
everybody would, but most people aren't, <clears throat> you know, a lot of things are, they're not even painful, but they're uncomfortable, you know, they require you to be out of your comfort zone, but they have valuable results at the end. Whereas if you choose to live a life of garbage, really, you know, of pleasure, you have nothing waiting at the finish line, nothing but a shitty result and a sad life. So choose wisely, guys.